10. That's a lot of ones on the right. Hmm. Yep. But that's not immediately something to go off of, unfortunately. I do like it when they give us the, the 10, because then it's just like, oh yeah. We can just slap down a bunch of things immediately. Not even have to worry. Uh, let's see. So there needs to be a two somewhere in that row. Hmm. Oh, the two would have to be there then. Yep. Okay, so this needs a two somewhere in here. And this that has to be six. Has to be six. Everything is done there, which means this is a two. We don't know about this one. Mm -hmm. uh, let's see. So that has to be two. Well, this. So we have the two here. This has to have a three. Oh, this has to be a two. Yeah. So you know those are closed off. Uh, let's see. Four and then two. Oh. Shoot. Uh... Hold up. You have to I replace up. one of those. Uh, shoot. Actually, we missed up on this row as well. It likes this too. Okay, so we've got the one. Well, that has to be three down there. This has to be three. We know this has to be a two. likes that one. That has to be a three. That has to be a two. Okay. Okay, that looks good. Right? Yeah. Unless the six is over one. Oh, oh right. We know that's there. I'm just, um... Oh. No. Because this... This column is done. Mm hmm Okay. It means that's there. So to be six, you'd have to have it extend even further. There we go. So now that's that's done concretely. And then you'd have to have the X and then the two. There we go. Okay. We don't know about that one. This row is good. Well, actually, you do know that one. Go up. You have to do three. Oh, yeah. We know that. But three. And then E2. Yep, two. you're right. Okay, so far, not breaking any rules. Okay, so far, so good. There's a two somewhere. Oh, in that here. has to be X off. Okay. Yeah. Which means uh that. So that has to be the two. Uh hold up. Something's wrong here. This is a two, two, and a one. Mm -hmm. Take out that previous. Now that has to be a two. That's good. Oh, and no, that has to be a four. So that's good. This is good. This is good. But how else would you get three one? A 
think that's it. With that? Mm -hmm. I think so, yeah. Yeah, also, if you notice, the pattern matches better. It does. Put an X down there. This? Wait. To the right. Oh. Well, that needs to be X'd off. But to the far right. Why here? Because you need one, one, one. Oh, you're right. Okay, bottom is done. So there we go. It's a uh, tape, tape recorder, recorder, yeah. I'd love it if we kept finding like little bits of recording equipment that are mm -hmm. recording us. It's like, oh yeah, we are on a show. Huh. Magnetic storage, VHS, Betamax, no. Oh, this is audio audio cassette recorder. Maybe Blake used it for dictating? Looks like there's a tape inside. It's got something written on the label. SM66 tape zero, uh, zero 01. Or just tape 1. SM66 could be a code. Initiating brute force, brute force algorithm. That, 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 that. What was that about Madonna or something? I have no idea. Stop, stop. We're never going to figure anything out like that. Just play the tape, and we'll go from there. Okay, initiating playback. Who are you? What do you want? Don't play dumb with me. You know what you... You really want me to... Uh, isn't there anything else I can do? Clock's ticking, Blake. All right, all right, just don't... Finishing up on set right now. I'll go, uh... My apologies, Honor. The recording seems to be damaged. Some of the audio has been lost. I heard enough. Blake was being threatened. I just wish I could tell who he was talking to. There may be more information. I'll continue playback. Okay, it's done. I told her she's off the show. Jesus, how am I? Explain this to the network. Ah, so see, someone wanted her fired. It's not my problem. Well, we're done now, right? Just... Gah. Oh. Give me... The rest of the photos and get out. So fast. We're... Hold on to these, just in case. So someone was blackmailing some photos against him. It was never part of the deal. This is... Calm down, Blake. I... Supposed to be over. I'm... What should I have done from the start? Away from that phone. I won't warn you again. And then they clobber him over the head. Get your hands off me. Gah! He... He was killed because of me. It sounds like they were blackmailing him somehow. Someone wanted me off the show so badly they... I'm sorry, Honor. I wish you could do more to identify the killer's voice. It's not your fault, Scout. We'll figure this out somehow and find out who this tape recorder belongs to. Is uh, And finding out who this tape recorder belongs to is our next step. Is it Tully's camcorder or someone else's? What's going on? Oh, there's a 10 at the bottom. Oh yeah, that's easy. Okay. Oh, there's a 7 up there. That makes life a lot easier. Oh, X over there for the one and the one. Give me a second. Er. Uh, what did you want? Where? Oh, you, you filled it in. Oh, okay. It's probably going to be symmetrical. Let's try to do the six. Uh... 
No, because there's a oh, there is there's the a asymmetry in, in the things. Up. Yeah, so there's okay. there's absolutely some kind of asymmetry. I d I don't want to mm -hmm. beef don't with that too see. much. Oh yeah, you're right about the three in the middle. Uh -huh. Uh -huh. Oh, well that's empty. So it has to be this. Mm -hmm. Let's see. Oh, well, that has to be one. One. So, These yeah. are ones. I think. So those have to be ex um, yeah. blacked in, right there, down. But this. Right. Right. Yeah, those two. Why? Yeah, those two. Because look at the one, one, one. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. Sorry, I was thinking X in. I'm getting a little sleepy. Yeah, I figure. Okay, X those out. I still want to finish this case, but my my puzzling... This case? I think the whole game is this case. No, no, no. There's four chapters. There's four chapters? Yeah. Hmm. Remember four cases at the very very beginning. Don't tell me you, for, you forgot. For the menu? Yeah. Okay. On the main menu, there were four cases. Okay. And you were... Oh, you were too distracted because you wanted to disambiguate the uh, the trailer. <laughs> See, that's it. That's that. These are all twos. It's like some weird smile. Oh, it's a letter. Oh, a letter. Blake's mail. Blackmail. Look at all these letters. Blake must have been going through some fan mail. It's stacks of this stuff every month. What for? Nothing really. People just want to say, say that they like the show. I guess it helps them feel closer to us. If they want to be closer, why don't they visit the studio? I mean, emotionally, Scout. The fans get to know us through the show, and they write to us. Well, mostly they want to write to Becky, but you get the idea. Here, I'll read you one. To whoever wrote episode six. I, I hope you trip and fall on your pencil, bleed all over the floor, and die in agony. Sounds like YouTube comments. Mm-hmm. I had somebody straight up uh, saying that I should be a janitor today. Because I suck at video games. That was a weird one. I would not advise following this person to get closer to you. Emotionally or otherwise. Well, allowing them to. But yeah. Oh, what did I say? You said following. Or oh, following. Following the directions. That's yeah. what I was thinking. Here's another one. Mr. Patterson. You chewed up Murder Miss Terry and crapped out a sorry excuse of a new season. If I ever have the misfortune to meet you in the street, I'll open you up and make you eat your own guts. Then maybe you'll know how it, you made the fans feel. This isn't fan mail. It's hate mail. There are 14 envelopes here with the same handwriting. I calculated 98% probability that they're all from one person. And they're all signed with the same thing. Shadow Showmaster 66. Hey, SM66, right? Mm-hmm. Could it be the same, some kind of nickname? Tape recorder's label, label said SM66. Could be a shortened version of the same name. Of course. Whoever Showmaster 66 is, they had access to the studio and a vendetta. That must be who killed Blake. But what's their real identity? Hey there, gorgeous. Got time to talk? This really isn't the time or place for a chat. We're standing in a crime scene. A uh, crime scene, huh? Pretty cool. Pretty cool. Uh, yeah, and you don't want Detective Cross to find you in here. So what are you doing in here? Me? I was just, uh, looking for my car keys. I get that. I lose things all the time. Want me to help you look? 
I could move this desk pretty easy if you wanted to check under. Wait a second. How about we just leave the desk and the body where it is? This guy is so dumb. Mm -hmm. Right. Yeah, whatever you say. Did you come in here for a reason? For the greatest reason of all, love. I wanted to get you alone for a while. Ah. There's something between us, don't you feel it? A few feet of concrete wouldn't be a bad start. What makes you think there's something between us? Because I can't stop thinking about you. I was kind of hoping that maybe you feel the same. You got a... You got that detective to believe you're innocent. Maybe you can do the same for me, and we can go and... Look, you're a good-looking guy, but this is not the time. One of my best friends is dead. He's literally right there. You're right. I'm sorry. Guess I got carried away. Hey, is Becky single? So, what do you do around here? Don't think I've seen you on the set. Oh, you know, whatever comes up. Keep my tools with me. And I go where they tell me to go. Didn't you say you were a carpenter earlier? If there's carpentry needs doing, sure. If something needs screwing, I'll do that too. And if something needs nailing down, just call me. Uh, who's that rap guy? MC Ham something? Hamper? Hammer. Point <laughs> is, I'm whatever you need me to be. Except weekends, evenings, and every fourth Wednesday. That's when I do bodybuilding. Every fourth Wednesday? <laughs> Mom taught me three things. Take care of your body. Don't cuss. Don't listen to Pa, because he's a goddamn drunk. Proud to say I've lived by those rules every day of my life. And when I have kids, I'm going to teach them the same. Well, maybe not the last one. You must be pretty strong. You get in many fights? Who, me? What's that got to do with anything? Based on visual assessment, you could easily be capable of killing someone if you wanted to. Hey, what are you trying to say? What do you think of John Redfern? Could he be a killer? Noodle arms back there, no way. Then again, when I was at school, a scrawny nerd knocked some other kid out with a chessboard. So yeah, if John had a weapon or something, guess is possible. What do you think about Becky? She's pretty. Got a hell of a temper, though. You don't want to get on her bad oh. side. Oh, sorry. You don't want to get on her bad side. Trust me. I come from a long line of mouthy broads. I'm used to it. You think that kind of anger might have been enough for Becky to kill Blake? I doubt it. My ma was always yelling, but she never killed nobody. But that would explain where Pa went. Uh... What do you make of Detective Cross? Ain't much like the detectives on TV, is he? Or is he? Ah, the syncopation there was weird. What you really need is someone like them on... Oh, what's that show again? Murder, murder something. Ah, uh, something, something. Miss... Misty something. Mistletoe. Miss Terry? It's Murder Miss Terry. That's right. I bet they'd sort this whole mess out... Mess right out. Say, now that I mention it, you look kind of like the, uh, bleh. you look kind of like one of the chicks on that show. Anyone ever tell you that? Yeah, I get that a lot. Present evidence. How come you got an idea with my face on it? Ain't that identity theft or something? This is your ID card. We found it in the break room. Shoot, must have dropped it. Really gotta get new pockets for these overalls. How long have you worked here? Not long, few weeks, I guess. But then why does he have the old card? Really? Bill said this ID card design is old. Like, a decade old. I, uh, I don't know what to tell you. That's the one they gave me when I started here. Come on, baby, you know you can trust me. Nope. I think Blake's killer dyed their hair as part of a disguise. Do you... Me? Dye my hair? Baby, I'm young. I'm virile. See any grays up on my head? Well, no, but... Ha! Didn't think so. You're only as old as you feel. That's what Gramps used to say. 
Although he died bungee jumping in 92. So, take that with a grain of salt. We found these letters on Blake's desk. Have you ever written to the studio? It's kind of embarrassing, but I don't really write much. Mostly stick to invoices and Christmas cards. And even then, I make mistakes. One Christmas, I accidentally sent bright red lingerie to the hardware store instead of my girl at the time. Would have been fine, except she woke up to Christmas morning with an invoice for 14 feet of plywood. And she still hasn't paid. <laughs> what about this name? Showmaster66. Do you recognize it? That's a name? Sounds more like an exercise bike. This tape recording has the audio of Blake's death. Someone was trying to blackmail him. I need answers, Tully. Where were you at 4.30 p.m. today? Uh, I don't really keep track of time most days. I think I was working on the set. Do you have any proof? What do you think all these tools are for? I ain't here to build a dollhouse. Did you want your screwdriver back? Huh? Oh, that's where my screwdriver went. Thought I'd lost it. You did lose it. Then we found it. Oh yeah, I remember now. It's cool. Consider it a gift. Thanks. Oh no, not the tampon. <laughs> not the tampon. <laughs> Chase him away. <laughs> Real fast. Here is... Do uh, we find everything in the room? I Possibly? Let's see if there's anybody to talk to. Oh, wait. We need to talk, ask him about the hair dyeing. Can you tell me anything about this bottle? Hmm. Where did you get this? This is color brand hair dye. Trust me, Otto. You don't want this stuff anywhere near your head. Bill found it in Blake's office. Not a product you'd recommend, I take it. You'd be better off using spray paint. I threw all that trash out years ago, and I've been very strict with our suppliers. I spent a long time explaining all the painful ways it could be inserted into the sales guy if they tried to flog me any uh, flog me anymore. So, someone else must have brought it in. This could belong to the killer. If you ask me, you'd have to be a psycho to use that stuff. But why would a murderer need hair dye? A quick disguise, maybe? Oh, Becky again, isn't it? What the hell was that? I think it was Becky. It sounded like it came from the set. Do you think she found another body? You'd better go check. Uh, me? What? I would love to be there to back you up. But I should probably stay here. In case the killer tries to hide uh, in the fridge. Location unlocked. Set. I was expecting this to be short, but no. How strange. This room doesn't seem to be finished. It's a TV set, Scout. This is where we film Murder Miss Terry. Becky? Are you here? Get away from me, you freak! I said get away from me! What's going on? Uh, don't sneak up on me like that, you idiot. Are you okay? Is someone else... Oh, crap. He's coming this way. I'm getting out of here. If he asks, you didn't see me. Got it? Is it... Is it the... The creeper fan? Probably. If who asks? Ah! Becky, please. I just want you to read something. Uh, uh. Oh, hi, Otter. Uh, say, did Becky come this way? Oh, what? Uh, uh, no, I, I don't think so. Oh, dang it. I guess I'll just wait here in case she comes back. I can't believe it. I'm really here on set! 
What are you doing in here? Why did Becky scream like that? Oh, well, well, I guess I surprised her. I never realized TV studios were so dark. So you were just standing around in the dark on an empty set. Not just any empty set. This is the actual set where Murder Mystery is filmed. Uh, yeah, it was. So, you're a pretty big fan of the show. Absolutely, Miss Terry, Becky, is pretty much my idol. Uh, don't get me wrong, I love your character too. Miss Terry and Detective Oates are the greatest TV detectives of all time. Thanks, John. It's just a shame it's all over. Over? You don't think they canceled the show, do you? How can we carry on without Blake? He was the one who brought us all together. It was his show, as much as everyone's. But, but you have to keep going. Think of it as a tribute to him, a memorial season. Wouldn't that be the best way to honor his work? Even if we wanted to, there'd be no Detective Oates. One of the last things Blake did was cancel my contract for the next season. By the killer. You're kidding! You can't have Terry without Oates! That's ridiculous! You think that's ridiculous? Wait until you hear about the talking poodle. As soon as I get home, I'm posting on alt.tv mystery about this. There will be angry letters, black faxes, riots! You really want Becky to like you, huh? She's so cool. I just wish she'd talk to me. No matter what I say, she looks at me like I'm something nasty she stepped in. I don't understand. Becky has shown no signs of interest in you, but you keep trying. Because she's Miss Freaking Terry! I might have no chance, but I've got to try, even if she tells me to go to hell. At least she spoke to me. That's terrible. <laughs> I can't decide if that's sweet or just creepy. You don't have to know if she's into po poetry, do you? I don't think so. Why? No reason. What do you think about Tully? He's such a jerk. All muscle, no brains. And the way he's always flirting with Becky, it makes me sick. If you're trying to find a murderer around here, he's big enough to do it. And stupid enough to not hide it properly either. Why do women always go for meatheads like him? Where there are good guys like me just waiting to be given a chance. Gee, uh, I don't know. Maybe if you respected them as people instead of acting like they owe you something? That'd be a good start. Oh, sure. And what would you know about it? Sorry, didn't mean to snap at you. Well, this murder stuff has got me pretty tense. It's over the letters. Do any of these letters look familiar to you? No, 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 why would they? Just a wild guess. Uh, you've sent fan mail before, right? I'll bet you know our address by heart. I've also memorized the studio phone and fax numbers and my 10-digit membership code for Mysteries Junior Investigators Club. But I haven't sent any fan mail recently. A and who signed these so-called letters anyway? You won't find my name at the bottom, that's for sure. True, there's... Uh, oh. True, they're signed... They're signed by Showmaster66. That's a pretty cool handle, but but I don't recognize it. Really? Uh-huh. Do you dye your hair, John? Well, I thought about dyeing my hair some wild, some kind of wild color. Wouldn't that be crazy? <laughs> anyway, I decided not to. People might think I'm some kind of pop star, and I don't want that kind of attention. Plus, my mom said it's really bad for your hair, so... I don't know what this is. Do you recognize this ID card? No, oh, sorry. Wait, is that a real studio ID? That's so cool. You didn't get one when you arrived? There was no one in the security booth outside, so I thought it wouldn't hurt anyone if I came in to look around. So you're saying you snuck into the studio? Y yes, but I wasn't doing anything weird. 